it's like I feel numb, like this is not even happening. Kevin Wood overcome with grief, thinking of the torture his wife Mary Wood endured after detectives say an irate man came into the store around 3 a.m. and brutally beat and stabbed her. He threw a bottle supposedly at my wife, a bottle. My wife was putting up the cigarette stock and cigarettes. She didn't even, there was no words exchanged. Then the guy jumps over the counter and starts stabbing her. Wood says his wife was hit in the head with a hammer and violently stabbed over and over again. The detective said that she was a trooper because she was fighting back the whole time. And that's my wife, you know, she's a fighter. They found a broken knife. They stabbed her 20 times, lacerations all over her head, her face, her arms. And, um, They found a hammer. He says Mary was able to push the panic button before blacking out. She now has a fractured nose, a chipped skull, and he says she's lucky to be alive. This is not life threatening, but you know, um, good thing it didn't hit no arteries they were saying, you know, um, it could have been worse. It could have not happened at all. Mary, who is also a teaching assistant, just started working at the gas station only a month ago to help the family pay off some debt. She took a part-time job at night on top of a 40-hour uh, full-time job. While she recovers from her injuries in this incomprehensible attack, he's grateful police have tracked down the attacker. I am so grateful that the, the Jefferson Parish Sheriff's Office did their job, you know, and, and I praise them for it.